I'm not sure there are many other nonprofit founders who started their organizations on April 1st, and no less April 1st, 2009, at the height of the greatest recession in the country in 70 years. But I'm very pleased to say that April 1st, 2019 marked the 10th anniversary of Convergence, a period of great growth for us, a period of great success. And I want to start by thanking any of you who have been involved with us over the years to help Convergence reach this milestone. We're very proud to be alive at 10 years, and we have big ambitions for the future. You know, I started Convergence because I thought there was a missing uh, capacity in Washington, D.C., and also around the country. There really was no place for people who disagreed on major issues, but really wanted to solve them, to sit down, get to know each other, build relationships with trust, and get to places that you can't otherwise get. Too often, people just debated each other and then went to their corners. And Convergence over the years has created a unique niche of influence on major national issues, ranging from healthcare to education to incarceration to mobility, uh, to long-term care and more. And that's been the hallmark of our work, that we've been able to bring together people who have the collective knowledge, experience, and influence to really move the dial on big national issues. And that will remain in our next decade the cornerstone of what we do, which is to bring together people who want to resolve and address big national issues through the unique methodology that we have uh, moved forward so effectively. Beyond that, in the next decade, we also have expanded our mission to both inspire and support others who want to use collaborative processes to make a difference in our society. So we're preparing ourselves to help other people use these processes, and I'm very pleased to announce that we've actually been invited by an entity of Congress to help them function more effectively, and we hope to take these ideas out even more broadly. I think the bottom line for us, and I know so many of you share this view, is that we want a society that's less polarized, less divided, that's more effective in solving problems, and we think we are a piece of the answer to that. And we're pleased to be in community with so many others who want to make sure our democracy is strong, that we address the issues that divide us effectively, and really uh, deal with the fact there's a lot of unnecessary differences that can be resolved amicably and positively for good effect to help solve problems to improve the lives of millions of people in our country. So again, I want to thank so many of you who helped Convergence achieve all that it's achieved. We want to invite any of you who are not yet involved with Convergence to come in and be part of what we're doing. We hope together we can create the kind of civil and effective and functional society we all want in this country. Thank you.